COVID-19 has changed so many things in society, but we didn't want it to interrupt a show of thanks to the men and women who protect our community each day. Annually, NBC6 hosts a Salute the Badge banquet showcasing the individuals and stories we tell about first responders all throughout the year. So instead, we took the show on the road. We appreciate y'all coming out. Coming out to Chevy Land on Uri Drive for a small show of support for a line of work with a large impact. I cannot think of a better year to tell all of our uh, first responders thank you. COVID-19 canceled our annual banquet, so we went to personally deliver plaques of appreciation to first responders we've profiled this year. It makes me feel good because obviously people see it and people recognize it and people are willing to honor that and show their way of saying thank you. So it's, it's, it's great. The Good Neighbor Chevy dealers on board since day one. It's very important to me. It's very important to Chevy Land. It's very important to the Good Neighbor Dealers Association. We're all real proud of these guys and, and what they do and what they do for our community. Some breaking glass ceilings. The first female fire investigator for the city of Shreveport. Others dedicating a lifetime to community service. 30 years and one month wow. to this date. My dad retired from the Caddo Sheriff's Office at 34 years. This is all I've ever known. Oh, it makes me feel great. You know, I don't do it for the recognition, but it's glad to see that some people out there still care. Recognizing the humanity that sometimes goes unnoticed. I know that you all have a life beyond your, uh, your badge, and that's what this program is about. It's more important than ever. Five years ago, we got behind the program from the initiation, and it was important then. It continues to become more and more important, and especially right now. And over the next two weeks, we will be heading to locations throughout the Arklatex to salute the badge. Tomorrow, we'll do so at Red River Chevrolet on Traffic Street in Bossier City.